it's been a while. I, I say a while, it has been exactly a couple of days, but you know. We finished spoiler territory. I'm loading this on my backup specifically. Because then I don't have the save file, I don't have to worry about people logging on. So I don't have to worry about, you know, people's games popping up and I feel bad doing that. <laughs> but I've never finished this game. And I got really into Legend of Zelda in 2018, alongside Mario. So let's finish this together. I found I'm really good at finishing games if uh, I have Twitch with me. So we're gonna get to explore this game together. I legitimately don't remember a lot of what I actually learned. I don't remember a lot of how to solve the puzzles and stuff. So it's- I forgot to close the window one second. It helps if I close the window. There's a lot of cars that like to be loud. But welcome to Link's Awakening, everyone! Big Yoshi egg, yes. Mess with volume on my headphones a bit. Uh, actually, when this game was first announced, I wanted to draw in this art style so bad. And I'm still really sad I didn't get the art book. But I got some goodies of it, so... As you can see on this one, I have no save file. So this way, it can be a complete new experience once again. Uh, I legitimately do not remember a lot of what happened, so I'm pretty much going to be struggling through everything. <laughs> but welcome back into the streams, Tatsu. Yeah, I love the false perspective. It's why Link's Awakening is one of my- f not Link's Awakening. Uh, Link Between Worlds is one of my favorite. Link's Awakening is one of the favorites as well, but it's not the ultimate. OG Ben 10. Ooh, how was that? I do. I legitimately do not remember. Yeah, no, we're just gonna do normal. You know what? Because I like to rename the protagonists. Uh, ooh, what did- what version was this one? I don't think I have it saved on my phone. I'm gonna click on my computer for a quick second. I have, uh, a, a few Zelda <laughs> themed OCs. And I'm trying to remember which was the one I gave for this. You know, I'm gonna go with this one instead. I like this name better. So we're gonna call him Lurus. <laughs> Lunk. I mean, Tatsu, you can name it Lunk if you want, but this is Lurus for me. I have a lot of Zelda OCs, please don't judge me. You have to have one for every single game. But I got pretty far into the game and then I just stopped playing it. Hence why I don't remember a lot. It's been like a good a year or two since I played it. I love Myron. She's my favorite. What a relief. I thought you'd never wake up. You were tossing and turning. What, Zelda? No, my name's Myron. You must be feeling a little woozy. <laughs> Hello, Gonmas. Welcome to Link's Awakening. The remake, because I don't have the original. I never played the original. Uh, my first ever Zelda game was Wind Waker, and I never finished it. I was a kid. So the only ones I've played are the ones that I could get available for the 3DS and the Switch so far. The 8-Bit Lanky, thank you for following! 
I've never played Phantom Hourglass. I want to get the Wind Waker sequels. It is my future. Like, goal is to play as many Zelda games as I can. That is a mood. But we're going to be going through quite a few of them. Uh, I'm going to do the Hyrule Warrior games, and I'm going to do Breath of the Wild. After this one, though. So we're going to get through this one and go on a big journey. Barry, finish all the Zelda games first. They're more important than Mario. You are on Koholan Kohol Islands. I love this game. It's so cute. Follow the lane south to reach the beach where I found you. Since you washed ashore, there's lots of nasty monsters that have been in that area, so be careful, okay? Well, Loris, you finally snapped out of it. Name's Taryn. Hope you're feeling better. What, how did I know your name? You think it's weird, eh? Well, I saw it on the back of this shield. We just conveniently have our name on the back of the Hyrule shield? Okay, I'm buying it. Zelda is the best protagonist, yes. Oh, I should have done that. That would have angered so many people if I called the if I called him Zelda. <laughs> am I that evil? No. I am not that evil. But yeah, um I have lots of fond memories of playing through the Zelda games, such as taking two years to finish playing Breath of the Wild. Chicken. That's the hint phone house. I remember this. Hey man, when you want to save, hit up the system screen. You get there by opening the subscreen, by pressing the plus, then R to get to the system screen. Uh, don't ask me what that means, I'm just a kid. <laughs> Long the Zelda. Oh, that's evil, Barry. I love it. Yeah, I am- I'm unfortunately not that evil. I remember, uh, I used to try and grind money by, like, running with a sword through this entire area just to buy stuff. And every time I would hit the poor fox by accident, I would honestly cry? That's a change up. Look at the baby. No, you're not having this chicken. Be free. That is not freedom. Be free. Be free. Okay. I can't be funny. Tatsu just wants to instantly pick up Link. Just like, this is mine now. I actually do have a Wind Waker Link plushie. It's him in his, um, pajamas. Okay. Push, 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 push. Oop. Oh, I can't go that way. So I wanna- Ow. It's been a while. Please be nice to me, Octo Rocks. There's my sword. Crunches Link? <laughs> no, don't crunch Link. He would. Hoot hoot, so you were the lad who owns this sword. Now I understand why the monsters are starting to attack so violently. A courageous lad has come to wake the windfish. It is said that you cannot leave this island unless you wake the windfish. You should now go north to the mysterious forest. I will wait for you there. Hoot. <laughs> Tatsu is about to eat Link. Like an M&M &M chocolate. The fear. You found your sword. It must be yours because it has your name engraved on it. But what if it's not my sword? So now I can attack. Boom. 
Repeat. Give me rupees. He looks like he's made out of fro- Oh, that would be really cute. Like a little Link frosting cake. Now I'm hungry. I want cake. God damn it. I've had food today. Well, that's a future goal. Get a Link cake. I still really like Legend of Zelda. It just- I had to take a break from it because I was playing so much Zelda. Uh, I haven't finished Majora's Mask, but... I own the Switch version of that, which I've heard is a lot more difficult. Um... My biggest memory was when I was playing Ocarina of Time, and I was halfway through... Um... I was halfway through the water dungeon, and my 3DS's little Joy-Con it broke in half, so I had to hunt for a new 3DS. Oh, I am gonna be playing that, don't worry, Tatsu. Um, that is not what I wanted. I wanted to ban them. <laughs> Accidental timeout. Look at the little babies. So evil! <laughs> My Bao Bao is so proud of his fine fur coat. F fur coat? Okay, I'm, I'm a bit scared. I'm gonna leave, lady. I didn't think Chain Chomps had fur coats. But yeah, I would just grind out money so I could buy everything. This was specifically how I would do it. I would just cut grass. I'm not gonna do that on stream apart from this once, but please just imagine me being so bored in my free time and I needed money. I would just sit for hours and cut this grass to grind cash. Oh, shell. Secret shell, but what do you do with it? I know that's important for something. I don't remember what exactly. This is the game where if you try to steal from the shopkeeper, they attack you, right? Or am I remembering that wrong? Me slover. <laughs> the Kulikron's Keeper. Uh, yeah, Tatsu is true. What Tatsu says. 200 rupees, I don't have that. Um, yeah, that's if you lose your shield. Yeah, I don't I don't have the money for that. I'm gonna come back later. Put a child in- No! Hello, Marin. Hi, Taran went to the forest to look for totsus, but I'd rather sing. Listen to this. It's called The Ballad of the Windfish. Enjoy this song. <laughs> that hoe over Tatsu. This is a pretty song. I want to sing it one day. <laughs> I went back and I blocked the bot. I didn't leave the timeout. Honestly, I love this game. I'm kind of sad I never finished it because I got really close. But, yeah, just murdering Link. Sorry, he had to. Uh, no, I want to go to the forest. Link dies the game. Oh, uh, what's this sign? Mysterious forest ahead, moblins... Mysterious forest, moblins ahead, they are not friendly. 
fair. Credits roll? Yep, that's the stream, guys. Uh, sorry, Link died. We'll be back next week with more Legend of Zelda. What's that boy? Little Link fell down the well? <laughs> Hoot ho, brave lad. On your quest to awake the dreamer, welcome to the mysterious forest. Much of the mystery you will find in most of, much of the mystery you will find on this uncharted Koholan island. I'm afraid you may be a, it may find it a trifle difficult to leave the island while the windfish naps. By the by, have you ever visited Tail Cave, which is south of the village? Go there with the key you find in this forest. And the windfish is watching. Hoot. He is dead because <laughs> Tatsu, please don't eat Link. He needs to save this island. I remember I got stuck on this island. Like, I don't remember why, I was just getting super stuck. I think it's because I couldn't figure out what to do. I had to look up a walkthrough. <laughs> Yeah, it was like here. I got past this bit and then I couldn't figure out what to do for the life of me. Boop. As a raccoon, my nose is very sensitive to stuff like dust and powder. You're gonna be lost thanks to me. Yeah, I think I got to like here and I got stuck. Uh, I don't think those are holes I can fall down. Ah, it's the choo choos. My enemies. It me. Tatsu's just out here trolling. Yeah, I think. This is a part I kind of got a bit stuck on. They couldn't figure out what to do. Excuse me, ma'am. I just need to, um... Check for rupees. I am the rupee inspector. You've still got plenty of pep. Come see me when you feel like you can't go on. Done. Trying to remember how the game works. No. I don't think I can get that chest yet. Yeah, I think I have to get the thing to move that first. Link falls down a chasm. Hmm? Slapper is also cold. I remember I could get this early, but I just- I'm not gonna bother over it. I'll get it later. Thank you for perishing. Du -du -du -du. You picked up the toadstool. As you hold it over your head, a mellow aroma falls, flows into your nostrils. Yeah, I think that's the bit where I got stuck. Because obviously, I couldn't figure out how to do it. I'm trying to keep an eye on chat, but it's very difficult to like play the game while looking at chat. I'm bad at this. Uh, now I have to remember how to get out of here. Can't, can't go to the there. Yeah, I think that was one of the issues, was I couldn't remember how to get out. And I still don't remember how to get out. Uh, maybe like... Uh... Push that, maybe? 
It works. We flex in that shared brain cell three times in a row. Well, I mean, as long as you're enjoying sharing the brain cell. Oh no, I missed the. Rip. Look at me, I got this. Purple rupee. Purple. Can I push that that way? No. Rip. Maybe if I go like this. There we go. I am a toad. Princess Tatsu, Princess Toadstool? Oh no. Tatsu, you're peach now? You know, I could draw that. I might draw that. I'm gonna draw it. I'm gonna draw Tatsu's Princess Peach. sensitive to stuff like dust and powder. Um, I think I need to then head back out if I remember right. I could be wrong. Oh, I just realized I almost have enough rupees to afford what I need. I'm gonna try and 100% the game. I can't guarantee it, but I'm gonna try. Oh, that was so close. Hitting the fox, I was scared. I'm always scared when I'm like super close to the fox and I do the spin attack. Or just like wanting to hit like the thing. Ooh, I have bad memories of that. Huh. I did not know that. To be very careful against the cuckoo, too. I know they are the enemy. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. No, I don't have enough yet, so put that back. I'm not gonna steal from this guy. He'll murder me. But yes, the life of grinding rupees is this area. I was actually playing a bit of a hat in time before this, and I was really bored, so I went into the dev console and I just started like flying around. Because I was really curious about like some out of bounds stuff. It was really fun. If you've never gone like out of bounds in a game that let you, it's really interesting. don't think it's that way. I want to go down, I think. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Is there anything in here? Uh, um, hmm. How to say, please call outside? It seems like old man Rira is a shy guy in person. I keep wanting to dash and then I realize I don't have that ability yet. It is a sad day when you cannot go fast. You can try to attack me. But you do not have shield. You got a piece of power, you can feel the energy flowing for you. 
Okay, this is where your attack gets buffed. Uh, I don't know why I'm going the right way. That's where the key is. I'm trying to remember how this island works. Um, I can't go that way. <laughs> I think I have to take the mushroom to someone. If I remember rightly. Am I remembering that correctly or not? Yeah. I thought it was someone, but I can't remember... I couldn't remember where to take it. That's the problem. Be so careful because you were right there. The grind for rupees is an inevitable one. I don't know what's worse, grinding for rupees in a regular Zelda game, or grinding for rupees in Breath of the Wild. I think Breath of the Wild, because I can't just cut the grass to get rupees. I actually have to earn it. I'm the biggest disappointment. Can't cut grass. Like, I kind of remember. Like, I know I can't go this way yet. Because I need, like, the power bracelet to lift those. Like, I can't go in there because I need the power bracelet. <laughs> the weird kid is destroying your garden again. Hey, look, it's not my fault that they literally pay me to do this. If they don't want me to cut their grass, they wouldn't leave rupees in it. I'm gonna have to leave that bit because I don't want to hit the fox. I have too many bad memories of that fox hitting me back. It was all by accident. What if rupees are plants? Interesting. I'm not sure. Actually, did these change up? Not yet. How much? Is it for me to play? Turn the game, one play, ten rupees. The buttons move the crane, the rest is just timing. Go over to the buttons, press play, good luck. Crane games! Legitimately hell. This was so annoying, late game. <laughs> so it's not by getting like these ones, but the rupees are the worst. Oh, Yoshi, Yoshi, you bitch. <laughs> this is why nobody likes Yoshi. gets on the conveyor belt. Yoshi, why are you just not behaving? Yoshi just decided he hated me. Oh, I don't think that's... Oh. Oh, now that's just me. <laughs> That is just mean. I'm 
There. Come on. There we go. No. And now I have to earn back money because sh this should have only taken me a little bit of rupees. Yoshi doll, you can't count how many games you've seen him in now. And a piece of heart. What a rare find. Son of a- <clears throat> Well, you and the Yoshi doll, you've been trying to do that forever. Our mom is really desperate to have one. Well, okay, it's my doll now. Fox, do not give me that kind of fear again. I don't mind killing the monsters, but I don't want to hit you. The heart race was rising, the tension was rising. I could hear it. I could hear Roxas like behind me. It was scary. I think their mom is this way. I say as I don't remember. Oh, will you give me that Yoshi doll? Oh, will you give that Yoshi doll to my baby? Oh, thank you. You're indeed a generous person. I will give you this in return. You traded your Yoshi doll for a pink ribbon. Maybe you can trade this ribbon for something else. Peace. No. Bad. I will stop streaming. <laughs> if there's anything any good Legend of Zelda player should fear, it's the chickens. But what if you're playing a game without the chickens? Then it's the pigs. That's all you need to know. Fear them. They are the scariest thing in this game. Season 3? Wasn't that one already out, or was that a different season? I don't know these guys. They must just not like visitors that bad. You know, they had one too many salesmen knocking at the door, and they were just like, you know, enough is enough. a salesman under that rock? Um... Turn to game, one play, ten rupees. I'm gonna try one time. I will not get addicted to the trendy crane game. I will not get addicted to the trendy crane game. Oh, now that is just cheap. Crane games are all a scam. Please do not get addicted to them. As I said, crane games are all a scam. I have a shovel I need to save for and that is more important than some stupid crane game. I will do the crane game off screen because then I can just grind for rupees. Fox giving me anxiety again. I would feel bad making you guys sit for me just doing this for like hours on end. Just to earn rupees. There we go. We now have enough for a shovel. Which I assume I'm gonna need. It's okay, we're used to suffering. 
Deluxe shovel, 200 rupees, seems expensive. Thanks a lot and come again. Got a shovel, now you can feel the joy of digging. I am sorry, okay? Now we have a shovel. We can dig. I know I have to come in here for the bow. Yeah, I don't remember where I have to go. We're going for dog food. I don't remember who the dog food goes to. Ocelot, you know this game better than me. Can you remind me where I have to go? To... Get the fa I know what I have to do. Do I have to like walk through the beach or is it like... Like continue going up? Through the air- like through this area? Okay, so I am just misremembering mis how I played it the first time. Those foxes give me more anxiety than the cuckoos. If I can ever find a way to get like an N64, I would love to stream Ocarina of Time. But I don't know if my sister even has her N64 still. And I don't know where I would get like a hold of Ocarina of Time. Please give me a rupee. Rupee, please. Yeah, I thought I had to like go talk to someone, but I guess I misremembered. Because it does that. And then... He's there, I can't get in there because of that. Two choos, thank you. You guys are darling, I love you. Is it this way? It's probably this way. Oh god, my enemies. No. I oh, can't go that way. Is it here? Yeah, it's here. Ma'am? Hello? Ah, it has... The sleepy toadstool, it does. We'll mix it something in a jiffy, we will. It's already it is. Take care, as there's not much there. Why not try a bit in my hut? Magic powder. Yeah. So I was I was right. I did have to talk to someone, I just couldn't remember where they were. Good, use it on your enemies and see what happens. If you run out, go to the forest and pick up some toadstools and I will make more. Come back without a toadstool and you may have to pay a price for my leftovers. Right, this will all go fine as long as I don't waste it, as I am prone to doing. Those guys give me so much anxiety. Zora. Old school Zora as well. I think they're River Zora as. You got a Guardian Acon. Boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Can't go that way. Boop, boop. 
<laughs> Thank you very much, Ocelot. Then I think it's... Watch the raccoon die. Yeah, I think that's the bit where I got stuck because I didn't know where to take it. And then I put it down and then I looked it up. The last thing I can remember is biting into a big juicy toadstool. Then I had the darnest dream I was a raccoon. Yeah, sounds strange, but it sure was fun. I'll well, tuck it out. I think I better set a spell before heading home. Yeah, um... Are you sure this is the best place to rest, sir? You know, in the forest with monsters. Can I take that off my wiki? No. I'll have to wait until I get my next item. Okay. I can never hit Y again. <laughs> Open. Tail key, now you can open the tailgate cave. It's a me, Raccoon. Who take the key and go to tail cave? Retrieve the instrument that is hidden there and I'll go. The windfish is waiting. I can't wait till I can get one of the most useful items in this entire game. So I wanna go down this way. Boop, boop. The choo choos, the green choo choos. I know of them. So then I wanna go. Down here. Huh. Mm, but I don't want to waste the powder. Am I heading the right way? Yes. Oh! I might try that then. Like, after I've done this. Let's unlock the first dungeon. You get weird ass eyes. Oh, that sounds scary. I have to find. Oh, the green ones? I know where they are. They're in the cave where I've still got that piece of heart to collect. Level one, tail cave. <laughs> this was the only way I knew how to kill them. <laughs> Got a small key, I can open his locked door. Oh no, wait. Damage taken by half. I feel lied to. You got a compass, now you can see where the night chests and nightmares are hidden. This compass has a new feature. Its tone will tell you if a key is nearby. Nearby. Open. Get a key. Small key, it can open the locked door. Longer, but like longer. Twenty 
rupees. Joy! Small key. Uh, can't do anything there. Use a key. Can't get there yet, but at least it's open. That is locked. I need to go about that a different way. Inky bunger. Cannot get up there, so maybe this way. Oh. I missed my dash ability. Ow. I forgot. I'm stupid at taking damage. to get the beak for the statue before I can do this. Go across the top. They no longer wish to be consumed. They will do the consuming. Oh, oopsie. go. Oh, I forgot about that. Give me heart. Oh yeah, this way. So then that gets me back into that room. What do I get here? That's the map. At last, you got map. Press that to look at it. So I know I can get through there. I can't jump there yet. I don't remember how to open that. Uh, and I can't get through there yet. I need to get the beak for the statue. There's a chest there. <laughs> so I think I have to figure out a way into that room. Link, can you just step into this wall for me? Thank you, sweetie. Oh, that's already open. I'm just being dumb. was the right one but it worked stone beak now to find an owl statue to fit into it I don't think it's this one I think it's the other one I want more no don't worry about it Tatsu I, I assume you're busy I'm gonna put it in kind of want to but mm. I don't know if I should risk it. I know I need the feather for that, so I think I need to get through to here. I wonder if I just leave and respawn the room. Can I get, like, other treats? Boop. 
Yeah, I'm gonna put up the beacon here. It's more important if I get the beacon to this one, because I feel this room is gonna be more important to get into. If there is a door you can open, move a square on the block. There we go. No, 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 Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. Oh, I feel so sad. Turn aside the spine ones of the shield. R.I.P. Bloopy. Ah, uh, yes. The Goombas. They are here. You got a piece of the Triforce of Power. It's a me, Mario Link. Oh, yeah, I can't get that yet. The Rock of Fever. Well, Rock's Fever. It feels like your body is lighter. Ultimately, my favorite power up. Because <laughs> I just did this all the time. It's time for Link to jump. He must jump up in the air, and jump without a care. Jump up and your tears will soar away. It's not a blue bee, but you know, we'll accept it. Yeah, cause that now lets me fall over holes even more. Goodbye, single rupee. You will be missed. Ah, heart. That's what I need. Um, I can't get that way yet. Boop. But I can now get... Ow. Yeah, I need the hearts now. <laughs> uh, I hit the wrong button. Uh, I'm gonna actually switch you guys around. I think X for jump will be better. Come on. I'm already dying. Kill it with fire. Hello, man. That's teleporting back to the main. I cannot jump over them. I need the main key before I can do that. That's just if I want life, I don't need it. Mario. Let's see. I don't remember how to get into here. Uh, because it's been a while since I've done it. I think I have to jump there, unlock that, and get into there. But I kind of want that other chest too, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, Ocelot, do you remember how to get that last chest? They're just 
hanging out. bombs which I don't have yet so I'll have to come back here so I want to go up I could I almost forgot about that That is the easiest way I found to deal with these guys. <laughs> Open to get the boss key. A key block. Imagine that would be super weird security wise. I can probably come back here. I'm pretty sure you can come back. I'm gonna make a save. Now the question is, are we gonna try and do this deathless? Because I remember in my original, I did try to do it deathless. Turn aside the spines one with a shield. those back into order. We're gonna go fight the boss. I'm gonna leave a save here. I almost forgot about that. I'm just gonna. <laughs> Un, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Thank you. <laughs> Beyblade Hardcore. Thanks for not opening. Well, you know what? Time to implore my strats for how I beat this boss the first time. Buzz Buzz Outsider. Modrum. Yes, I would just stand by the door with the shield at the ready. <laughs> If it works, it works. Fear of bon 
burger worm. I meant to say bunger worm. It's like, no, it's not bunger. Bunger's a different game. <laughs> Let's take the violin. You got, oh, it's a cello. You got the full moon cello. Burgerant. Bungerant. Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. I think I was two instruments away from the f end of the game when I first played it. Burger the bunger. V would murder us. Swamp. A path opens in the blooms. I'm gonna go see if the guy has the bombs for sale yet. Now I'm gonna go get them. I don't remember when the shell comes in use, but it's always good to get it ready. Call for me. Hey, as long as it works. Hoot, that is an instrument of the sirens. I have to admit, at first I did not believe you were real. That instrument, alongside the seven others in set, has the power to wake the windfish. You must collect them all. I was instructed to give you directions. Your next goal is north in the Gong Goponga Swamp. Hoot indeed. I love this game. It's so cute. You wanna see something cool now? Nothing can hold me back. I can jump. But apparently I can't knock apples off a tree. Hey buddy, it's serious. Yeah, real serious. Yeah, it is. The moblins came to the village. Yeah, that's right. A whole gang of moblins. Then, for, it's for real. They went into the house. Yeah, the house. And they did something to Bowel's house. It was really bad scene with the moblins. So, I mean, uh... It might be faster to find out for yourself what happened. Yeah, they, they stole her chain help. It's terrible. My bow was dognapped by mob mo moblins. Oh, uh, please, somebody help my poor bow -wow. We have to save him. Or her. The doggo has been stolen. We must return the doggo to its owner. Yeah, that's not a lot. Unga book. <laughs> Ooh, boom. But that's a lot of rupees. I'll come back for that. I'll save up. Um, I think... I have to go, like, here first to get that I could be misremembering, because I know I can't go that way yet. I don't think I can go that way yet. I do remember, though, I got really sad after this dungeon and I didn't get to keep Bowel. Like, safe to my heart. That was so sweet. Where's the pupper? <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Thank you. Heart piece now, yeah. And I can do the powder now. Uh, put that on Y. Oh, I'm a change blob, and that's not all I have to say. Now that I have lips, I fantasize about playing one of these island songs on a flute. There are free hot lips. 
Purple hits. Literally, those blobs are magic. Literally. If no other tool will do the job, pull out one of those songs you got stuck in your head. I'm guessing when I get... Yeah, I can't do that yet. Am I disturbed? Possibly. Telltale Heights. Yeah, this is where I want to come. Uh, we're one away from a new heart. Blob has eyes now. I can do powder now. <laughs> uh, who's a suspicious looking run? Okay, boys, let's get rid of him. I love this music. It's a bop. Come on. Must be an assassin sent by Madame Meow Meow to rescue the mutt. You came here to get me, but it is I who will get you. I don't know if I loaded on the right save. <laughs> Ivy. She I realize like none of my mods are here, so Oh! I just realized V's here. I can do V's command now. So what was it again? V I made a command for you. Yeah, this command for a few of you guys. I may have to update Tatsu's. I still scream. You do. I, I just want to change it a bit. Okay, uh, so for that guy I need to get him into the wall. So I want to try and avoid taking as many hits. Tatsumaki screaming ASMR. I can see that. I could see it. Let's go make a save. Yeah, now we have that save. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Okay, so I'm gonna have to figure out the best way to deal with the. There we go. This game made me want to cry. That's a mood. I hate looking. I hate looking a bird. <laughs> look, look the me. I, I cannot English at the minute. I'm sorry. I'll call back later. You must be an assassin sent by Madame Meow Meow to rescue the mutt. You came here to get me, but it is I who will get you. Okay. 
You saved Biao. What a fearsome beast. This part was so cute. I remember I love this bit. Like, look at it. Look at Leaky's funny little chain chomp. We will be playing for Breath of the Wild uh, all over again. I'm not sure. I don't think I'll do it on master mode because <laughs> I fear Lionel's more than my life. Hoot, that is a fearsome looking animal you have there. Do not forget, the next instrument is in the Gompa Swamp. Oh yeah, V, we've talked to you already. V, why did you have to tell me that? Now I'm absolutely terrified to ever start Master Mode. What's the statue do? I didn't talk to it. The windfish in name only, for it is Neaver. Okay, that's scary. Hello, Dompei. Hey, you met out of there? That speaks well of you. Maybe you can help me out with a little job. I'm Dompei, and my job around the island is to dig up interesting stuff. When you have some time to spare, come see me at my shack over there. I don't want to go into the wasteland yet. I can at least unlock it on the map. That's his shack. Well, this looks pretty heavy. You won't be able to lift this with just your bare hands. I can't remember what I need to do there. I think I need, like, a future item. What a good boy! <laughs> I'm going to cry when I play Master Mode with the Lionel starts following me. Don't worry, I cry in regular mode when the Lionels follow me. It's this way we want to go. I remember we want to take the Chain Chomp with us. Is it this way? Cause that's the swamp. Uh, I can't access it for this way. I think I have to go back through the for- Yeah, I have to go back through the forest. I watched my friend stream Breath of the Wild at Master Mode and he ran away from the Lionel by sh the shock arrows and after he grabbed it, it just teleported in front of him. I went looking around for the way to avoid that because I did not want to deal with that Lionel. I was so scared of that Lionel. That Lionel terrified me. Lionels are scary, like, I'm sorry, uh, the Zora, I love you, but I'm not about to go fight a Lionel. If you need me, I'll, I'll be over in, um, the Gerudo town, yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's just distracting me. I hated them. So badly. No! <laughs> In normal mode, they don't scare me anymore, but that first time I was like, oh. Anytime I see a Lionel, I'm like, oh no, thank you, goodbye. I do not need this in my life. Lionel's scary. Not if you sneak. I try to sneak. And it, the minute it spotted me, it's like, nope, I'm out of here, goodbye. Danger, keep out. Except Bow Wow. I don't remember the route. I think I have to go this way.
Yeah, so now you have to go around like. Hey, Lolo, do you mind dealing with the big thing over there? And now this thing down here. Thank you, Bella, sweetie. Let's see. I want to go over here to get out. So I do want to go down this way. Should I buy? I I did buy the sneak armor, but I I don't want to get close to a Lionel. They're scary. Have you been near a Lionel? <laughs> Gunmus is living up to the job of a mod. Never shout out. Oh, did I not leave it up? I'll try that again. There you go. <laughs> oh, it's a super good game. I'm gonna be playing it after I play Hyrule Warriors, which is after this one. Oh, I can't do these yet because I need the thingy to throw them. Oh, yeah, this one be out. Bow Wow leaves me. I miss Bow Wow. Okay, I'm gonna need the powder for this. There we go. I remember I got so sad. Wait, can you spare a heart? It Hi Volsey! Welcome in. Breath of the Wild does have its faults. It's just not a perfect game. I can 100% agree on that. But I really like it. Oh no, this is the one where I need the arrow. Uh, I don't want to grind the rupees for the arrow, though. Uh, anyone who plays this game and remember... Do you guys know if I can get the arrow in this dungeon or if I need it before going in? Because if I need it before going in, I'm gonna have to go grind a lot of rupees. <laughs> a lot, a lot of rupees. Yeah, honestly, I really enjoyed Breath of the Wild when I first played it. It took me two years to beat it, but I really enjoyed those two years of playing the game. I'm just gonna assume that I need... Hello, sweetie, could you... Now, money. Um, the Breath of the Wild edition, you mean Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity? I never finished that, but that is on my list to like replay for you guys to watch me suffer in. I got pretty far in, like right near the end, and then I just paused and never went back. Yeah, it's a super good game. I don't want my all to go home. I'm gonna be so sad if I lose B Bow Wow, because I still need Bow Wow. Oh well, 
Come on. You know what? For V. Nurse, Taran's taking a nap at home. I don't know how you can nap sleep on such a nice day. It makes me want to sing a song, yes. The song is the Ballad of the Windfish. It's V! Oh, I hear a chain jump. I can't wait till I can get the instrument because I know you can get one in this game. Yeah, I need to now grind out to get the bow and arrow. <laughs> Which is gonna be a fun experience. I haven't I haven't unlocked Marin and Hyrule Warriors yet. Thank you. Those foxes scare me more than anything, because I'll just be in the middle of grinding my grass cutting experience. And then they'll just go, hey, uh, nice grass you're cutting there. Uh, mind if I step in? I've hit them so many times on accident, it makes me sad. So, we have some time while I try and grind out the exact amount of rupees I need to be able to buy the bow and arrow because I can't do that dungeon without it. Bella, sweetie, you just stay outside. I'll be back. Oh, Bella's coming with me. Yeah, I need that many rupees and I know I need the bow and arrow set. They attack you and it it scares me. <laughs> um, Back when I first got into Legend of Zelda, I started reading like a bunch of different like fan-made comics about the series and boy do you guys want me to share a couple of those comics with you? Would you guys be interested about hearing the really cool Zelda comics that I came across? They're specifically free I want to talk about because I still would read them any day of the week. And it gives us something to talk about while you guys sit here and watch me grind for rupees. Because really that's all I can do at the minute. Chicken, you are lucky. I mean, we've got, we've got some time to talk on this fine Sunday. I'm probably just gonna stream this game for a little bit. Probably at least do up to the second dungeon. And then pause for the day and come back to this game later. And I'm not doing the stupid crane game to earn rupees because it's just gonna be a waste of time. And we might as well talk. So how, how is everyone? How's your week been? Everyone had a good week? Bad week? Anything you want to talk about? Feel free. Let's have a, let's have a chat. While I grind rupees. Go summer, that's good. V, go eat, sweetie. <laughs> go eat or Marin will be really sad. No, you know what? Go eat or we'll eat Bunger. You are, but do you, you know, Marin would eat Bunger. You are what you eat. Which one I can afford it, that game may be on the list to play. I won't promise anything. Not Bunger. We'll go and get some food and then Bunger will be safe. Do you think Teddy would want you to not have food? Teddy would. And Teddy's currently telling me that he would eat Bunger if you don't get food. Bed is warm, but food is important. Do 
Would you rather eat food or would you rather stay in bed warm? You can always go back to bed. Food is important. You need food to be healthy and like continue to like exist. And if you eat, you'll be less tired. Because you can also get a good drink, like water. Yes, but can you actually eat that food? I don't think you can, sweetie. Please, go get something to eat. If you are hungry, you eat food. I'm watching you, Cuckoo. V? I will add a command, which is just an amount of bungers eaten. Do not tempt me. I will find out how to add number counting into a command on Nightbot, and I will add a command that is just bug snacks. And then people can eat bug snacks. Good. <laughs> the threat of people eating bug snacks worked. Yes, I know this is boring, but I realize in this dungeon I need. I need the bow and arrow. And that's a lot of rupees. So we're gonna be here for a while. Why is it? Oh, that was close. If I hit that chicken one more time, I feel I would have been dead. But we get more time with Bow Wow. Where is my rupees? There. Yeah, I specifically remember needing it because, like, I try to 100% the dungeons when I can, if I go in. And since the bow and arrow is available, it's, it's the one with, like, the crystals and you, like, need to hit them. But obviously some of them I need, like, the bow and arrow for because I can't, like, hit a crystal twice while, with a sword. And I don't like have the like the little blade charge like you know you do in Breath of the Wild when you're master sword when you are at full health and you like hit with the master sword. Hey clock. We're on a rupee grind because I realized I need the bow and arrow for this dungeon. But it means we get more time with Bow Wow. So, you know, we take what we can get. My mods are all busy, so I am the mod for today. Why would you tell me that? I did not need to know that. I want to point out on my regular gameplay, this was also what my entire life was turned into for rupees. Link would do anything for rupees and one of them is constantly mow this grass that keeps growing back. <laughs> I do not like my own voice. I... Don't know why. I think it's just because I think it sounds weird. I wanna jump. <laughs> I wish I could jump over the rocks, that would be cool. Oh, that's the wrong one. I'm also not gonna play the crane game to try and get rupees because crane games are a scam. Specifically that one. And it has ruined my trust in this guy. And I don't I don't want you guys to see me become addicted to the crane game purely just because this guy would not give me my Yoshi Yoshi doll. My rightfully earned Yoshi doll. I paid my ten rupees. 
Oh, I missed a rupee. My voice is not very... It is very... Weird. <laughs> Yoshi, how could you betray me like this? Look, just because I say uwu a lot does not mean my voice is uwu. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> don't even worry about it. Not what you're gonna say, Barry. <laughs> Uh, I would like to disagree on that statement. Do you know whose voice is very uwu? Marin. Ergo, V's voice is very uwu. Because V is Marin. At least the chicken's out my way now. But, um, back when I first got. <laughs> Smile. Because you're my friend. If you guys haven't seen uh, V streams, you should totally check it out. V just finished streaming Persona 4. And it was a wild ride to be sat through and watch. And I'm honestly glad I got to watch the majority of V's experience with it. Persona 4 is a very good game. It has its flaws, but, you know, not every game is going to be perfect. And I still like the game, honestly, to this day. V made me want to play for it again. But with how I play Persona games, it would be a very boring stream. Because I specifically work on my... Petals of Will, thank you for following. Welcome into the grind for rupees. Everyone here has the voice of an angel and that is final. That is fair. But I, I would like to disagree. I think I have the voice of a devil. Devils are cooler. Or at least a fallen angel. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I need to buy the bow and arrow set and I don't want to steal from this poor guy. He might get mad at me. You know, I've, I've, been, I've been in business with Tom Nook once in my entire life and he scares me. My voice is not cute. We are almost there. <laughs> Just, uh, hang on how many rupees? We have to get 980 rupees. I forgot we were friends. I, I did post the link. In multiple servers, so... <laughs> that could also be the case. There. No, I'm just being dumb. The butterfly has distracted me. Um, because everyone here is adorable? I would like to say. Does Petals stream? Ah. Oh, finally, one of my mods. Hey, love, sweetie. Could you shout people out for me? Thank you. We're grinding for rupees. I need the bow and arrow and I don't want to do the crane game. It has hurt me one too many times. We must fight back against the grass and hope it will give us rupees. We're hoping specifically for bloopies. 
because that's a lot of rupees there. <laughs> uh, you don't stream pedals? Okay, good to know. I wasn't sure. <laughs> Uh, v clock gonna s follow, follow pedals anyways hey Mia welcome into the rupee grinding stream can we get a shadow for Mia please Mia's a really good artist you should definitely check her out they have really really cute art As is everyone in the stream. Actually, give Lavender a shout out too. Really adorable art. Did my starting soon screen. And I'm so proud of them. You say that, but... You forget I'm also able to shout people out. <laughs> Smile. Um, but if you guys like Legend of Zelda, I have a couple of cute comic suggestions to s suggest for you guys. There is the Growing Up Gerudo comic, which I haven't caught up with it for a bit, so I need to like sit through and recatch up with it. But Growing Up Gerudo is a story where. Link was basically raised by Ganon in Ocarina of Time instead. And Ganon is Link's dad. And at least from what I remember reading, it was super dorky. And like they had a bunch of really cute Gerudos, like OCs and stuff. Like it was super cool. And the artists like have really super cool art. Like, it's a really sketchy style comic, but it's a style I, I really appreciate and like. Another one that I checked out was the Linked Universe comic, which was a bunch of links. They are all like stuck together and they have to solve like a problem. Like something is going wrong with the world. And it covers the majority of the links and obviously uses the lore that we know so far for like some of the links so like there's the breath of the wild link but obviously it covers majorly what uh we knew about breath of the wild link and then when breath of the wild 2 was announced like they kind of like put in their own little spur what wholesome reputation you think i'm wholesome V is like, must shout out Gonmas. But Gonmas has really cool art. You should also check out Gonmas' art. And every so often, Gonmas will speedrun Hollow Knight. Oh no. Can you please move, Mr. Fox? Thank you. <laughs> now, can you move again by the time I get there? I would appreciate it. Can you, can you move a bit more? Thank you. <sighs> that fox has given me so much anxiety by accidentally hitting it with the sword. We are almost there. <laughs> We're 500 rupees. The foxes are adorable and I feel bad whenever I hit them. Yip yip! Yes. True. You act innocent on your streams, though. And I think that's where I kind of got the idea. And then I went into your server and I saw that... No. <laughs> I'm not smacking the kuko. Um. And then I saw the dumpy emote. V. Also, I still cannot forget my favorite V clip. 
which has uh, been lovingly clipped by Clock when V was playing Birth by Sleep on International Women's Day. You all should go check out that clip, it's really good. Oh yeah, quote 5. Oh no, there are butts all over the screen. <laughs> Yo, quote five. I think out of everyone here, I think Barry is the most innocent person. Oh no, that that's actually an adorable emote. I love that emote. Why do you always bring the cutest bird emotes? Oh, Liv, when you get time, sweetie, you should watch... Uh, V's stream from last night. V finished P4! You can see your babies again. And V also is responsible for making me wanna, like, play through Persona again. All of them responsible for redrawing my OCs, wanting to redo one of my original Persona ideas, which was based for Persona 2 going into free. The KH Guides. Can we get a shout out for KH Guides? Welcome into the rupee farming stream where I need a bow and arrow. Oh. You should check out KH Guides, really cool fun person. Uh, they also have a wonderful website called khguides.com where uh, you can learn all of the things you would never knew about Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and 3. Although I think so far only the KH1 uh, part of the site has been re like remade. I don't know if they're doing all of it, but it's a really cool site. You should check it out. Especially if you're replaying Kingdom Hearts and you have no idea where all the chests are. Specifically in one, because it's not like it tracks it for us. <laughs> Sad. Uh, we've done the first dungeon. We're currently grinding because I realized I need the bow and arrow, and that's a lot of rupees and I don't have it. So, this has become my life. And I'm probably off screen when I can be bothered, just gonna sit and grind up more rupees. Because I come to this spot in town and I just grind. And grind. I have to grind 980 rupees. <laughs> so we're gonna be here for a bit. And then we're gonna do the second dungeon. And I have no reason to do the crane game. It robbed me. I don't feel comfortable going back in there. I don't gotta get addicted if I try again. And I'm, I, I can't do that. I just can't do it, man. I can't, I can't let the guy trick me again. He told me it's only 10 rupees and then he goes and tricks me like that. Makes it seem easy to get a Yoshi doll. It's not. For my own sanity and everyone else's, we're not gonna get addicted to the crane game. Boop. Boop. Mm. I should probably just get a drink real quick. I can feel my throat hating me. <laughs> But yeah, we're gonna be streaming this for a bit. I think I'm gonna take a break from Kingdom Hearts because I streamed it kind of like back to back and then I went back into replaying it straight away. And I think I should take like a little bit of a break from it and then continue to replay it or restart the entire thing. Cage guides. With all the baby vibes associated. Well, I mean, Sora is a baby. Just, my advice, uh, don't play Dream Drop Distance if you want your sanity by the end. You can play it for Flowmation, Dream Eaters, uh, but trust me, don't fight that final boss. Well, second final boss, it's not worth it. I'm still not over it. And I don't think I have the sanity to go through that game again. Oop. 
Why am I only getting single rupees? Can I have more? Oh no. We have another person who went all the way through. Yeah, that, I, I don't know if I'm gonna go back to grind my beginner save just to do the secret boss. I don't know if it's worth it. Um... I have been grinding my KH1 beginner save. Please move. Thank you, Fox. Um, because I want to do the secret bosses in Cage 1 at least. But I'm not going to do them until I'm level 99. And I don't think I could do any of the bosses on anything but beginner. Yeah, I've never beat that boss, so I wouldn't know. Uh, I think the only two games where I've almost completed 100% is Kingdom Hearts 3 and Kingdom Hearts 2. Um... Nothing in particularly... Thing. I had like a, um, a Sunday dinner, which is basically it's like chicken, potatoes, carrots, uh, turnip, and then it's like gravy and Yorkshire puddings. Which none of you will know what a Yorkshire pudding is. Sad. But we are having chicken curry tomorrow, so that's gonna be good. That is good. We have one person who knows what I'm talking about. I mean, I've never had KFC properly, but that's only because uh, where I live there wasn't one for ages. And then when there finally was one, it was when I was not able to afford it. Somehow I don't trust myself because I am just bad at money management. But I'm managing now. I'm saving up for a new art tablet because I plan to do art streams. But I can't with my current one because I feel incredibly claustrophobic using it. Wanna like... There we go. It's a... My current tablet is a 14 inch uh, Cintiq, but the screen is so small. It makes me feel like really claustrophobic using it. It was fine when I had the 15 inch laptop, but now that I have like a 27 inch screen, I don't think it's gonna cut it. We're almost there. They forgot my chicken. They gave my mom a st Oh, V, I'll fight them. I will fight them for you. <laughs> yeah, cause like, over here the portion sizes for McDonald's are like a lot smaller. But I think like in America, like they're really big, like... I think it would take maybe like... Four? portion sizes of what we have to make up one American size portion, possibly? Or like three. It's like a really big number. Because we like have very different portion sizes. <laughs> Please do not You guys are incredibly beautiful. Yeah, that's true. I mean, it's different for, like, every place. Okay, we're almost there. We only have another 300 rupees to go. This has turned into the... 
I have no idea what happened there. Did that fox just spawn in or was it just me? That scared me? It's not even like when I was in deep jungle. Oh no, we suppressed the funny number. Uh, I'm sorry. I wish I got more bloopies. I would appreciate the bloopies right now. Berries. <laughs> Bean, no! Ba -ba -da -ba -da. I'm sorry, Berry. I'm sorry. If you ever want to see raw energy, just when Barry is talking in a stream, just walk in and do the deep jungle song. And Barry will go from greeting you with a warm welcome to swearing at you. With love and affection. Oh no. I hit the fox. That's what happens when you don't pay attention. Reset so the fox is not angry at me anymore. turn into the grind rupees the stream but i find this route is the best way to grind the rupees up like when you have like to buy a really expensive item i could be wrong there could be a better place to grind but this is the best place i've found at least early game because of the big patch of grass It's just you have to be really careful not to hit the chicken and the fox. Can we hit 900 please? I want to hit 900 before I go insane. Rupee grinding. Ultimately, the best part about Legend of Zelda. Wouldn't be so bad if I was already finished the game, but you know. Oh no. Almost that far. Uh, the bow costs exactly 980. And I am grinding all of the rupees I can just to afford it because I know I need it. For how I play specifically. But I will be grinding off screen to do some of the stuff, such as like the. that crane game. I'm gonna do that off screen because you guys don't wanna see me suffer for that and get stressed out. I am still farming. I'm sorry, Gunmas, there is no end to this farming. I'm powerful. I wish I could be done already. And I hate repetition. But this is the best way to grind rupees, and I don't want to try and risk wasting 10 rupees just for a chance to get 50. Please move. You guys should see me when I'm trying to grind pawns in uh, Hat in Time. Which I'm gonna be playing that probably start to finish eventually. But as like the secondary protagonist, Bokid. Because I finished the game as Hackid.
Legend of Zelda Stardew Valley. I have Stardew Valley on the Switch. I also have it on PC. Most likely if I was to stream Stardew Valley, I would probably just have one, maybe two mods specifically installed. And just for, like, ease of life reasons, if I really struggle with something. Uh, specifically, I would have the mod that allows me to speed up my character walking speed because I hate how slow the character walks. Seven, seven, seven. Seven, seven, eight. Seven, seven, nine. I'm sorry, Mr. Cuckoo. We are exactly 200 away from our goal. Let's go. I need some boobies. Like, I could just steal it. But I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna ruin my reputation with a shopkeeper. If you don't... No... No trying to murder people. Honestly, I wish I could call the crane game a reliable way to get rupees, but I know with my look, it's not going to be, and I don't want to waste the rupees on it. So I'd rather just manually grind it out on the grass. Simulator, Legend of Zelda style. Okay, 800. We are almost there. When I get to 900, every 10 rupees will do a countdown. Till we hit 980. Come on. Come on, Bow Wow. You've been with me this long. Why were you there in the grass? I couldn't see you. Can we have some hot Hershey's chocolate? Okay, I got that. So now hopefully we'll give you nothing but rupees. Interesting I learned recently because I was watching um, something about Chain of Memories in specific like its development for the PS2 version. I found out that the base engine for that game is a game I actually played like quite a bit with my sister. A game called Musashi Samurai Legend. Because one of the leftovers is the starting world from that game. And I was like Wait, that was a Square game? Because I didn't actually know that Musashi Samurai Legend was made by Square. Or at least published by it. So that was something interesting I learned about a game I like. And Chain of Memories is that they share an engine. Please move, Fox. American candy stores. I mean, they do have them in. I don't know if you have them over there, Bob Elsa, but uh, B and M's is a store that sells Hershey's. <laughs> the fuck. 
box gives me anxiety. You give me so much anxiety just from being there. Why does the fox have to keep getting in my way? Come on, we're almost there. We're almost at the 900 mark, guys. She s'mores. That sounds interesting. I'll take a quick drink break. <clears throat> I'm gonna grind for that piece of heart off stream. I'm not making you guys sit for me getting that piece of heart on stream. I also likely will try and grind to get all of the shop stuff that I can off stream. Okay. We're almost there. We are almost at 900. We're making progress on the slow grind. But slow and steady wins the race. Two more. Cuckoo, why would you forsake me like that? Okay. Every ten... Every time I hit ten more rupees on the counter for 900. So when I hit 910, you guys count down. So just say the amount, okay? We're gonna make it. We've gotten this far. We can't give up yet. No matter how many times the fox walks in front of us. 910. No matter how many times the cuckoos get in our way. We will persevere. I'm gonna save real fast. <laughs> Just in case. We persevered through thick and thin together, folks. For the past hour, we've been grinding. <laughs> we need a lot of rupees. I don't know why that guy's selling a bow and arrow for that much. It's kind of overpriced, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, 920. Ooh, charges! 980 for a bow and arrow. That just seems like I'm being charged too much. Like, way too much for just something to go and fire at the enemies. But you know, Bow Wow's been here through it all with us. Bow Wow loves us. Bow Wow knows the pain. Bow Wow even agrees that it's overpriced for a bow and arrow. We gotta do it, because I know that Dungeon at least needs it for some of the puzzles. And it's gonna be good in the future. Especially because we can grind arrows out. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits, Petals. 930. Bow Wow is the best boy. Not as good as, like, some other boys, but you know. Definitely the best boy of Link's Awakening. Stuck for me through thick and thin, through every single rupee in this green green grass. The only person who had stuck for me through more was Epona. But Epona can't be here today. So it's just me and Bow Wow. The two best of boys. You ever think someone just looks out the window and thinks, what's that weird kid in the green doing? Oh, we hit 940. I didn't even notice. 
We're almost there, folks. We got 40 more to go. Soon to be 30. And why is this all? Because I realize I can't do the dungeon the way I would normally do it without the bow and arrow. And I'm pretty sure I need it anyways, so I might as well just get it. This is the grind I have taken before in this game. I know it well. I know it well is the best way to get all my rupees. This music has been comforting us. Marin has been looking at us like we're weird. She's been cheering us on. It's been a long grind. 960. But we're almost at the end. There's not far to go now. Funny number. 970. The amount of rupees we have left to get? Well, that's simple. Nine. Seven. Four, six. Five. Four. Three. Oh, we hit it! That five help helped us right at the end. But you know, we might as well finish cutting the grass. It it'd be a bit lame of us just not to finish the job, you know? And we might as well do the victory lap. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits, pedal. We hit it. Now, you demon, give me the bow and arrows. <laughs> I did this for the bow and arrow. It was needed. Okay, now let's go. Come on, my boy. We did this together. Oh, come on. Up here. And if I see a single ruby again, it's never gonna be too soon. Like I said, there's probably better places to grind. But that is so far the best place I've found. Wait, uh, which way do I need to go? Yeah, it's that way. Dig? Secret shell. Hey, welcome in. You just missed an hour of me gardening to get rupees. I gotta get it, I gotta get it. Put the pom-poms away. Yeah, I still gotta get through the dungeon. <laughs> gonna drop a save. Why is the chain jump all the way over there? There we go. Okay. Oh, I missed a rupee. Oh, that hurts. Hey, Rowan. Can we get a shout out for Rowan? Bottle Grotto. I can't believe I spent so long just grinding.
Then I want bow. Thank you, sir. There we go. We're always gonna be sweet. Especially to really cool people who deserve it. Ah, God damn it, Link. There we go. It's the shy guys. They don't do any harm from what I'm aware. Thank you for the heart. Um there's a lock door there. There is one over there, which I'll probably come back to do. Oh, I love this style. The game's so cute. Ow. I'm gonna move them into there. Jump, 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 jump. Oof. Okay. There we go. Oof. Oof. Scary. Okay. We need the magic powder. Oh, I wasted some. Guess that's not what I needed. Well, go through here. Ah, mini boss. Do this mini boss already. <laughs> I'm just gonna. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Everyone in this chat is. Adorable, very wholesome, very cool, whatever they wish to be called. I think I need to go... Back to the start. Because there is a door over here that I haven't been into yet. doing these games. Ow. Why would you do this to me? Why is this bat being so mean? Why is this bat bullying me? Why... Why is this bat specifically bullying me?
That bat was very specifically bullying me. Uh, it's a uh, a link, Link's Awakening. I don't, I can't stream Link Between Worlds. Oof. That bat was just being mean and just bullying me for no apparent reason. Oh wait, there was a. Uh, You lied to me. I'm slightly mad the game lied to me. Wonderful whatever we're having. The game lied to me and I feel robbed. There yet. Right. Uh. There we go. Now, do you have to do this to me? Ten, twenty rupees, yo. Wait, what? I looked away, what? Uh, I think I'm gonna have to go... in here, cause it's the only place I can go. There we go. Need to scare away the booze. Yeah, this is where I get the ability to pick up the pots. So that means I have to go around this way. Over and I can't get there. Uh, me trying to remember how to do this. Well, now I have to get along this way, and I can't do that yet until I turn that. So maybe if I. Yeah, I need to go that way. Pot murder. Everyone is so happy to murder the pots. I want to I wanna try and make a push to there. What's going to be dangerous? There we go. The map. Ooh, there we go. So yeah, that's a locked room. And then probably to there, so that's where I want to go. Thank you. Wanna save real quick? Clock murder? No, no. We're not gonna hurt you, clock. You're too sweet. First, defeat the imprisoned Pole's voice. Last, the skeletal style falls. Da 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 Okay. I think it's
Please. I don't remember how to do this. Uh, I'm leaving. It's that one I have to defeat first. But I don't remember how to... Unlock it? There we go. Um, maybe bow and arrow. that I have to attack this thing. Right. Nope. <laughs> Goodbye. Restart. Posture check. Got it. <laughs> Watch your back. Fiend, no. I mean, hey, I, I want to do the zero deaths, <laughs> so if I can cheat the system, I will cheat the system. I think that's where I want to be. Zero deaths worth it. It is. I, I, I remember hearing that you get something if you do it with zero deaths, so... If I can, I want to do it zero deaths. <laughs> 50 rupees, nice. So, it may take a while, cause obviously I'm gonna be... Um, grinding? A lot to get those 50, uh, not those 50, I'm gonna be grinding a lot of like title screen glitches just to not die. But it's worth it in the end. Um, so I need to head back, is it there? Let's see. I'm trying to remember where I have to go again. I think it's there. I want to go in to get to there. Yeah, I'm, I'm specifically doing it because I remember about the extra scene. And the bats are already being jerks. Use the Triforce of Power. You can feel its energy flowing for you. Jump. Smash. Jump. Jump on head. Jump there, jump there, and down we go! Up into view. Uh, 
No, it's because I defeated the bat, isn't it? Uh, I don't want him to do it again. Thank you. That's the right one I want. Yeah, because then I want to go to there. Oh. That was close. Then I want to use the bow there. And then I want to grab that. Smokey. Go this way. Really, 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 really. The keys are the worst. for some reason. I wonder if I use the magic powder on the bunny if it will do anything. I just have to hope. this because I don't have enough arrows. I don't want to like... So I may have to come back when I got more arrows for this bit. I don't remember... I don't want to save just to get more arrows so I can retry it. I think I need to go down... for the heart. May I have the key? I can move forward. Why? Why? Wait. Wait. I forgot the pots do damage to them. Oh, I can maybe do that room. I forgot that the pot does damage to it. you want to be a bunny boy. Please wait there. Keys. And then you're last. There we go. I was like, I'm out of arrows. How am I supposed to do this? I forgot the pot damages the bunny. That would have sucked. You made your character already. You, you can't make another one, I'm sorry. This 
especially because Bun Boys are going to be locked behind the DLC. So you'll have to wait a while, actually, to be able to unlock it. Uh, can't use the bow and arrow, which is great. Hello, can I please go this way? Sits and cries. I'm sorry! I mean, Melvier are always existed, it's just we never had them in the game until now. Um, how do I get down here again? I, I don't actually remember how to do this one. Uh, any oh, I needed a pot. I messed up, I need a pop. Damn it, Lincoln is instincts to smash all of the pots. You can smash all but one Link. And this is the one you must keep alive. He can't help it. It's in his blood. It is kind of interesting though that um, everything you get is kind of useful. In every dungeon. Now watch, I'm gonna have to grind. Oh, it's this boss. Yes, be a bunny boy reaper. Ho oh, ho ho, I'm your bad guy this time. Ho ho ho. Genie! Okay, Homer Simpson. Thing is, I actually don't know if I can do this without arrows. I don't think I can. Uh oh. I can't move, but I'm still alright. Your little sword won't break this bottle. Even the walls here are tougher than that little dink. Yeah, haha, -ha, you can't hurt me so long as I have my bottle. Okay, I cannot defend against that. Come on! Poor Genie, yeah. Genie wants another game. Why well, you broke my bottle while you make me hopping mad. I don't remember how to do this. I think I'm gonna have to go quickly get some arrows. At least this time I don't have to grind for rupees. I relate to this boss spiritually. We're trying to do this deathless, so... We're almost done. We just have to beat the boss. So I just need to go grind some arrows and then come back. I'm probably just gonna buy enough to have a full quiver full of arrows, come back and then... Yeah, yeah, I know you wanna go and bite them, baby. I know it's tempting, but you gotta be good. You 
got a guardian acorn and it will reduce the damage you take by half. Come on. You got a piece of the Triforce of Power. Am I going the wrong way? Yes, I am. Whoopee. Bow well, good boy. Bow well, very good boy. Do I grind out the rest of the rupees I would need to get that extra bit of heart? Do I? No. No. I don't think you guys could sit for me with another rupee grind. I think is the max I can hold. See, the arrows individually aren't that much, so why is the bow and arrow so much? Mm. To be fair though, having that extra heart would actually help a bit, I feel, because I could survive at least one more hit. But is it worth it to grind the 200? Have a good day, Petals. Thank you for hanging out. I'm gonna finish up a drawing I was doing uh, before the stream, and I might do some more uh, art of a specific person. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. V knows their name. Begins with a T and ends with an E. I've had lots of really cut kind of cool fun ideas for the character and it's kind of fun to draw anyways so and I don't know if the person is there so they won't know smile possibly smiles I also have to draw for someone else a couple of things they're a very good sweet friend of mine, and you guys should definitely check them out. Their name is Kafona. Kafona's really cool. It was actually Kafona who convinced me to stream this stream. So it's like, I kind of want to play Legend of Zelda games on stream, but I'm not sure which one to start with. And I gave the list of the ones that I could stream, and Kafona just went Link's Awakening. It's like, okay, I'll stream. Link's Awakening. So, they're a little bit chill, the Zelda streams, I'm gonna say, because obviously it's just gonna more so be me hanging out and talking. And probably it'll actually be a really good wind down from the weekend, especially when we get into Breath of the Wild until the Guardians come out to play. <laughs> and then I'm gonna be paralyzed in fear, yay! I, I have immense phobia of the Guardians and the Lionels. The music for the Guardians is what scares me the most. To the point where I went into Hyrule Castle, I heard the music and just noped out. 
was like, oh, this won't be too bad. I just have to get this one memory and da 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 and I'm gone, bye. I don't know what it is. Music will always be the thing that gets me to leave a place. I cannot think of one thing more scarier than scary music. Let's see, jump scares, eh, they're alright, they're loud, they're in your face. But they get annoying after a bit. Good atmosphere music, ooh, that's what does it, you know. If a game can set a really good spooky atmosphere, it wins. Don't worry, we're not grinding as much money this time. <laughs> God forbid we sit through another 900 grind. I'm not sitting here for another hour just grinding to 900. I only have to grind to, um... Two hundred now. Nope, uh, no one was talking about Tatsu. Don't worry about it, Tatsu. Smile. It is Mr. Tatsumaki himself. Can I get a shout out for Tatsu? Also, Tatsu, you missed the grind where I just spent a straight hour farming rupees in this exact order. I was just going around cutting down grass until I hit 980 rupees. It's the Legend of Zelda experience. We almost experience it once. Grinding for at least an hour straight to get rupees. We're gonna finish off the boss and then that'll probably be it for the stream. But I'm definitely gonna continue this game. It's very chill. And hey, at least Tatsu can come to these streams without having to worry about spoilers. Now he doesn't have to worry about the 20 spoilers. And the near spoilers. Hello, good sir, who charged me an arm and a leg for a bow. I would like a piece of heart. <laughs> Specifically so I could get a full maximum health increase. We, we have actually got uh, a bit emote for that. For uh, Tatsu getting not spoiled. This is the no spoilers emote, which Tatsu was the reason for its creation. Okay. You know what? One more time. Because I love this song. Okay, so I'm gonna drop a save. We're gonna head back. It's a bee. <laughs> v gets consumed by Chain Chomp. I hate puns. You don't deserve it, V. Bow Wow is a very good boy. Bow Wow stuck through me through two rupee grinds. Like, can it get any better? Opponent was the only other one to sit through those rupee grinds. Wait, which way was it for? I think it's this way. Actually, no way. I can go the other way. Ooh, I can do this now too. Actually, I can't do this now. I cannot double jump. Just... 
This way, Bowel. -Well. Thank you, Bowel. -Well. But yeah, now you can just pick up stones and throw them. It makes this a little bit easier. Okay. Now let's make our way to the boss. We got an extra heart. We have a full stack of arrows. And I remember how to do the boss now. So, I want to go up these stairs, I think, and then to there. You think you got me this time, Keys? Can't get me. Stupid Keys. Ooh, that was smooth. I miss Bow Wow. <laughs> Shit. They are. Uh, goodbye. Ooh, loopy. Guardian acorn? Down, down. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, pick that up. Up here. Drop a very quick save. The Legend of Wonk. <laughs> um, there is a reason for it. I don't want to state why the reason is. Because that would spoil it. Because I remember before this came out, I read up on the game. So I know the... Like, I kind of remember the gist of it, but I don't. Bro, genie. can't move, but I'm still alright. Your little sword won't break this bottle. Even the walls here are tougher than that little dinky thing. Yeah, huh? You can't hurt me so long as I have my bottle. Can you start throwing the fireballs? Ow. Boop. I'm very bad at not getting hit. Oh. Got my bottle, hopping mad, switch the arrows. Switch that for the shovel because I don't want to accidentally use up. Truvy. 
You got the conch horn. Prairie, prairie. The prairie is waiting. What a good boy! Now, unfortunately, we have to say goodbye to someone. They've been the goodest of boys. But I must return them home. They've come with me through thick and thin. But their mother's waiting for them back home. And as much as I'd love to keep them through my journey, I know the game just won't let me. Help. Thank you. <laughs> Bye, Tatsu! <laughs> wow. Tatsu slander in the chat today. Is this game gonna let me keep chain count for a bit longer? Oh, I really appreciate what you did for my poor precious Bow Wow. You were such a nice boy. However, can I repay you? I know. Um, you got a reward from Meta Meow Wow. Link, no, bad. Bellwell's the best of boys. But Bellwell must stay home. I don't know. I don't know if you can beat the game without returning Bellwell. So. This will be the end of the first part of this stream. We will probably continue it next weekend. But we did two dungeons, so that's pretty good. I'm gonna probably grind some coins off screen. Coins. Rupees off screen. So you guys don't have to watch me grind all of those rupees again. But for now, Homest is online. Give me Twitch homepage. How many people on do I follow? Um, we could write someone new, but uh, one of the people I follow on is Ninten. Oh, when does clock start? Uh, how long? Cause I can uh, sit and talk for a little bit until clock starts. Ostafia. Uh, Ostafia. Hey, yeah, I can write Ostafia. Um, are they streaming Final Fantasy Twelve? Is it? Uh, because. You would know them better than Ivy, so you couldn't probably tell me. Yeah. Yeah, we're right into Ostafia. I'm not following them yet, but I'll drop them to follow in a minute. But not a host. So we're gonna write into Ostafia. One of these friends. But I will see you guys not next Tuesday, because we're taking a break from Nier while I do some grinding. Gonna try and get some of the weapons leveled up to max. Um, but 
Thursday, we'll be starting a new full playthrough of a game. And we'll be continuing Legend of Zelda, and then we'll possibly get back to Nier the week after, or the week after that. We'll see. But for now, I hope you've all had a wonderful day. Let's go say hi to Ostafia. Drop some hearts and love. And we're gonna enjoy some fun FF12. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!